Hello, this is Daniel Watrous. In this video, I'm going to show you how to configure the messaging in WordPress opt-in crusher. So um, first off, we scroll down and there are two, uh, two areas where we can configure the messaging. One is in this opt-in lightbox message settings uh, and the other is in Aweber form details. So let's, let's look first at opt-in lightbox message settings. So there is a difference between the opt-in and the lightbox. And let's just have a look. The opt-in uh, form that I'm talking about is this one here that appears on the, the footer as it first rolls up. Now, notice there's a little call to action here. Click for details. And the cursor changes when you hover over either this title here or this um, uh, thumbnail over here. Well, when you click on these, the background fades and you see what's called a lightbox appear on top. So the light box repeats the same headline that you saw here and then it has some additional text here and uh, this could be text it could be a video um, and I'll show you an example of that in a minute and then it repeats your opt-in box inside kind of a dotted uh, line uh, border here so when we go come back to opt-in light box message settings the first thing you'll see is that we've got the call to action so I've got you know get my free report about taking over the world uh, hurry, so you're first. Okay, so I, I made a, a slight change there, and I click Update Settings, and what you'll notice now is that my opt-in footer, as it slides up, says it, it reflects that change, not only here, but also in the light box. Okay, so now the, the next uh, bit that you can change is the lightbox message itself. And so right here, I've got, if you've ever wanted to dominate the world and now is your chance and so on. Um, now, the, the great thing about this opt-in box is that you can include anything, uh, that, that, well, any HTML. So if I wanted this to be bold, for example, then I just change this to bold, click update settings, and then come back here and refresh. Now, when I show the light box, oh, I guess it's all bold. So here, let's let's change it to something that uh, that will show up a little better. Why don't we change this to underline? So again, we're just trying to draw some attention to it. Update settings. Okay, and now you'll see that that's underlined. Now. An underline in that particular case doesn't seem very impressive, but what I want to draw your attention to is that since this takes HTML, you can just as easily embed a YouTube video, for example. So let me just show you my website, or, uh, and, and you can see what I've done when, when my opt-in shows. Okay, so there it is. And you'll see that what I've got is, is you know, sign up to, uh, to my email list uh, or get my email list building software for free. And I've actually embedded a video right in the, the opt-in up here. So somebody can click play and start watching the video and let the video do the selling for the opt-in. Okay, so that's really powerful. Um, and, and that's the second bit of, of messaging that you can uh, configure. Of course, you can configure the font family, the font size. You, you can adjust things if you feel like you want the font over to, to one side or the other. Um, and, uh, you know, just fiddle around with those until you get them just right. Now, down here, there's another call to action button. And this is the text that goes in right here. And, you know, so some people would do something like, you know, download now. And they use the little less than, greater than symbols to draw attention to that that button. And so uh, what you'll notice now is uh, after I make that change, yeah, the button now it reflects whatever I put in there. So those are the the aspects of messaging. Oh, and whatever whatever text you choose for the button, it shows up in both places. So download now and download now, I'm uh, 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 both in the light box and down here. So those are the aspects of messaging that you can customize. And, uh, and, and I, I really hope you uh, find the, the perfect combination. If you don't, 
come in and keep testing. Thank you.